Semiconductor firms in Singapore can tap on a new $500 million fabrication facility by 2027. It is among strategies for the country to remain a semiconductor powerhouse and drive economic growth amid rising geopolitical tensions. The Trade and Industry Ministry says key focus areas include building strong enterprises and investing in the workforce. Nadira Zaidi has more. We are now entering a new chapter in our economic journey with new challenges and opportunities unlike those we have seen before. A sombre note from Deputy Prime Minister Gun Kim Yong as he described the state of the economy. Citing US President Trump's recent tariff plans, Mr Gun warns that it could spark a global trade war. We may not be significantly affected by the reciprocal tariffs directly. However, Rising tariffs and trade wars could cause disruptions to supply chains, slow down global trade and drive up business costs and therefore affect businesses and consumers. In the long term, in the longer term, it will also affect confidence and investment flows and slow down the global economy. But there are opportunities like in artificial intelligence, digitalization and shifts in production and supply chains. That's why Singapore is investing $500 million to build an R&D facility in Tampines focusing on advanced packaging technologies, which is a key growth area. Local semiconductor firm NextGen says a shared space like this allows for faster turnaround time and puts Singapore at pole position in the space. We are definitely punching above our weight and we have to be selective uh, into certain technologies where we cannot completely go full steam ahead on a bleeding cutting-edge technology node. We are picking applications that are commercially viable where we get a return on investment on a, on a um, I mean risk-reward ratio that is acceptable. Singapore is also strengthening its connectivity to the region and the world through the upcoming Johor Singapore Special Economic Zone. Here at home, more will be done to invest in people and help local businesses internationalize.